Welcome to Wisconsin. So, which one you want? I know which one I want. Huh? I'm gonna take this one because the cutting edge here and the pick there. So, I'm gonna take that one. You're gonna go with both of them. You gotta carry them. It's gonna be a Hey folks, Prospector Gill here. Say I'm up in the North Woods of Wisconsin once again doing a little bit of gold prospecting. I'm gonna take a couple little videos, show you a little bit what's going on. Uh, I don't have a whole lot of camera. Uh, uh, for some reason my GoPros don't last too long in the cold. So I'll tell you what, I'm gonna take a couple of videos and spice them together and show you what's going on. So I wanna say thanks for watching. I appreciate your time. I really love the subscriptions. It's awesome. Uh, when I get to 500, we're gonna have one heck of a giveaway going on. So there you go, folks. Like, subscribe, and share. And you know what? Check out my Patreon channel. I got a couple videos on there too. Uh, we're gifting away a little bit of gold here and there as well. So uh, check it out, folks. Thanks much. I, pre I appreciate your time. Thank you for watching. Prospect to get out. We'll see you soon. I see, I see. <laughs> Let's see what's going on down this way. Looking for a little place to go. I want to dig a little bit. And I'm not sure where I want to do it. Lots of deer tracks here. Nice little creek I know of. Northeast Wisconsin. Oh. I just got to get to the right place, that's all. I'll get there. Iceberg, crazy. Huh. Feel like an ice breaker. Good thing I have my waders on. Right up there even maybe. We'll see.
All right, folks, I think I found where I'm supposed to be going here. It's always an adventure when you're looking for gold. Off the beaten path. Boy, I tell you that. Follow the deer path, he said. You'll find where you're going. <laughs> I forgot to ask him what deer path. I was supposed to follow. Oh, there's, there's deer tracks everywhere. <laughs> boy, oh boy. Oh, I think this is the right deer path. I'm not sure. <sighs> so I was gonna maybe just dig right here. All right, let's see what goes on here. Look at that, right on the bank. All right, so the reason why I'm doing this is I'm going right on the inside of the bank here. Everything's coming up in here, getting caught. And I'm strolling back around that way. Theoretically, I get up in here a little bit. We'll see how far this ice goes down. See if there's any water underneath here, first of all. Hey folks, by the way, guess what? I turned 50 years old today. Not bad for a 50 year old guy, is it? Thanks for watching.
Man, this thing's heavy. All right. <sighs> All right. See this? It's two o'clock. In that hole, I think there's some gold. So, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a break for just a second. And, uh, hi, how you doing folks? Again, it's my 50th birthday today. How awesome is that? Out and about with my son, Michael. He's right there. He's my camera. He's my camera dude today. Yeah, professional. Look at how he's lounging. So, there you go. I'm gonna say right there in this little hole that I dug through the ice with my old uh, ice digger. I'm gonna clean it up. I'm gonna have a beer real quick. And uh, I'm gonna start classifying. Do a little bit of pan and see what's going on. Whew, here's a beer. There you go. Mmm. A little bit for Gaia. Hey folks, Prospector Gill here again. See, I'm digging right underneath where this big, huge, heavy rock was underneath here, underneath all the ice and everything that I just cleared out. And you know what? There's some pretty good material down here. I'm already on a little bit of clay stuff that's in here. So what I'm doing, I'm just classifying it down to a quarter of an inch. Nothing more than that. Again, and I'm gonna pan it all. I'm, I, I brought my sluice and stuff, but I don't think I'm gonna sluice it. We'll see. There's we're running water down there, but not right here. So I think I'm just gonna pan it all. All right, prospect to get out. See you soon. Hey folks. Come check this out. I just want to show you where I'm at right now. We're on that uh, gravelly, gravelly clay stuff. If you look at here, this is the stuff that you want to go after. This is where the gold, the, lay, the gold will hang out up in this stuff. You see, there's all the different color changes and stuff in there. This is why I say make sure you wash your rocks. You can. That's where the gold's going to be hanging out. So, when you're classifying and stuff, you see how tough that is? That's where the stuff's either going to be inside of it, or it's going to stay on the top of it and sit there like a false bedrock. Either way, whenever you get into material like this, this is what you're looking for. This is where the gold is at. So, you want to make sure... that see look at this you want to clean all your rocks and stuff you never know where the gold may be hanging out boy look at that big diamond I just found <laughs> it's not a diamond silly that's a big piece of ice <laughs> That's a nice piece of quartz, huh? There you go. All right. So, here's my first bucket. I got a couple more buckets to do. And then once I get a couple of clean full buckets, I'm just gonna pan them right here and we'll see what happens. We'll go from there, all right, folks? Prospect to get out. We'll see you soon.
There we go. You might want to put some more firewood on that fire, Mikey. That thing warmer. <laughs> Ooh, look at that nice rock. There you go, buddy. Put some bigger ones on there. Ooh. There's some clay. Look at that nice clay. Boy, oh boy. Wow, that's some hard clay. I'll take this. Put that up in there like that. Ooh, almost got my gloves. Ooh. Uh, it's hard digging. I got some bunch of big rocks down here. There's that clay again. Right there. That's nice. Careful where you walk in this creek. <laughs> you know. Oh, I missed. Your hands are cold, you can't feel the heat. <laughs> Let's put these on for just a few minutes. For those of you who don't know, I'm on blood thinners. So the cold really gets to me a little bit. So that I can stay warmer, I'm gonna stay warmer, boy oh boy. This water is kinda cold, it is winter. So, that's why I wear these things. I get cold enough, I don't need to be cold uh, all the time. And it's kind of deep right there. Cheapers. <laughs> All right, down to the clay layer already. That one spot. Haha. <laughs> See, it's much easier to do this whole classifying thing with these rubber gloves on. No big chunks of gold in there. Uh, Mikey, you come on, move my gloves, please. Uh, second time I got them wet. You say you don't want wet gloves? Yeah. <laughs> so, I'm on a nice, there's some big old rocks right here. Ugh. Well, there should be some good gold in here from all this clay I'm getting. I'm sorry? Yeah, don't burn them. You know what, I could do a test pan real quick. I think I'm gonna. Oh, 
I feel as though I'm on a shelf or something right there. Something just, something just clicked. Now there's a big old rock. I'm digging between a couple of rocks. That's the problem. There you go. Uh-oh. We gotta get this. Look at all that beautiful clay. I love this whole gold prospect and stuff. I'll tell you that much. Okay. Well, look at all that, uh, look at all that, uh, ice in there. Uh, there's clay in there, and that clay is so hard to stratify. You gotta get in there and stratify it your own self to get started. Huh? So we're gonna stratify that up, get all the heavy heavies down to the bottom of the pan. Any black sand and stuff that are in there. And we're just gonna kinda of take them light stuff off the top. And we'll see what happens. There's some heavier stuffs. We'll see what happens. Ooh, look at that. There's some gold. One, two, three, four, five. I don't know if you can see that or not. Ooh, but there's about five or so flakes of gold in there. That's pretty sweet. Well, I'm on the gold. Put that right back in there. Nice. Okay, well, there you go. There's some gold there. Where did my shovel go? <laughs> Here it is. How do you like my new waders? They're pretty cool. I don't have to worry about getting nothing wet anymore, except for my hands and stuff. You know, that they still get wet a little bit. Um, but, it get itchy. Anyway, 
I just wanted to show off my new waders. Look, look, wait, wait, look. Oh, I'm so deep in the hole. Oh, no, I fell all the way down. <laughs> all right. That line's still warm and dry. Come on, hang, hang on a second. So what I did, folks, is I kind of did a pan of a whole bunch of, of the catch range here. And can you see in here? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, some little pieces. Look at that. Holy cow. Like I said, I think I've got a little pocket here. Just I just been going down in one little spot. So that's pretty cool. Ooh, there's no, ooh, there was another one. Well, I'm not gonna get them all. I'm gonna put them back in there. I'm just like, holy cow. So like I said, I, I'm on it. So that's cool. Alright folks. Hey folks, Ross put the gill here. I think I found a little pocket of gold because like I've been getting some really good test pans. Um, my camera gear is really starting to freeze up. Probably because I had it down in here trying to see something, but I can't see anything because it's so dark and dirty and stuff. Anyway, um, I'm on the gold. I'm almost out of battery juice. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna finish this up and then we'll go back to Gold Shack and I'll show you what's going on. All right, folks, thanks so much for your time. I appreciate you like subscribe and share and hey you know what check out my patreon channel i got a couple of things going on there uh, a couple of gold giveaways and things like that going on all right folks see you soon so a couple of days ago i was out prospecting look what just happened last night we got about eight inches of snow it's cold as heck out here too. So anyway, check this out. I'm gonna repurpose one of these things. I have one with no bullet holes in it. <laughs> Imagine that. So I'm gonna make it all shiny, shiny. I got an idea for my stickers. I finally got some stickers from uh, another prospector. There you go. I'm going to repurpose one of these things and I hang it up in my uh, gold shack. Man cave gold shack or gold shack. It doesn't matter because I can move it when I'm done with it. It'll be pretty cool. All right, folks. See you soon. Hey, folks. Check this out. I got myself a big sticker. Remember now, I've been saying how I want stickers from people. Um, well... HD Shovel Ed, my man, hooked me up. Look at this stuff. He sent me a package. Ooh, he sent me a spoon, a little, little spoon, too. That's in, in the office. I'll go, have to go get that in a second. Jason Keith, my man. I like his videos. JP Lawns and more. I watch all these guys. Uh, big Flip, Silver, Gold Flippers. Flash in your pan. Of course, HD Shovel Ed. Another Jason Keith. That's kind of nice. Um, I, I, I'm going to pronounce this wrong. Melee Man 24. I have not heard of that. There's the HD Shovel Ed. That's nice. Um, Michigan 2 Sherry. Sherry Ward Outdoorsy. Sherry Ward Art Outdoorsy, I think is what, what it reads. Uh, that's cool. Another flash in your pan. ECP, East Coast Prospecting. Okay, cool, yeah, huh? cool. Uh, it looks like I have to go on to three other websites and uh, subscribe, I'm thinking. Uh, ooh, check this out. Tom's Gold Peter, that's pretty cool. Uh, I have to put that in my gift away. That is awesome. Um, wow, that's cool. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put all my stickers on here and you know what? There's going to be way more room for more. So if anybody has stickers, I have stickers to trade um, and or something. Uh, hit me up by my uh, email, I guess. Uh, it should be down underneath uh, the, the, the video. Um, all right. 
Well, when I get done with this, I'll show you what it's gonna look like. All right, for now, prospect to get out. We'll see you soon. Hey folks, Prospector Gill here. It's one degree outside right now. No prospecting for me, but I have got a couple of packages going out. One for Mr. Brandon, one for Mr. Mark Mitchell, one for Mr. Creed Flynn. Oh, that's uh, Brandon Townsend, my buddy down in Florida. Rock on, guys. Uh, I'm gonna go in and do this, and, uh, and then we'll get back to the gold check here real quick. All right, peace out, folks. I just turned that off, folks, because it's really, really loud. Um, so he, kind of here's what's going on. I've been trying to get this American Gold Prospectors Pater pan down and stuff, but every life just kind of keeps happening. And then, and then I was squirrel. Um, I went out to the creek the other day because. Um, I had to, <laughs> and I dug through the ice, and I got some concentrates here, and I started to pan them out in the creek, but I got a little cold, so I tell you what, my camera ran out of juice, and whatever. So, I came into the gold shed, shack, office, man cave, and uh, decided to do a little bit of rearranging. Got my cool little sign here, and I got some gift away stuff over on this table, which I can probably give you a little snapshot of uh, in a little while, just so you can see what's going on. Um, but I've been known to have a little kind of long, I've been known to have a long video. So I'm trying to make them a little bit shorter so I don't have so many hours of editing to do because it's turning my hair gray. <sighs> and y'all don't have like hours and hours to sit down and watch a full episode, I know. Time is precious for everybody. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, cut this one a little bit short um, for today, and uh, we'll get back. I'll we'll have like an episode two, I guess, of 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 a pen and a gold prospectus Peter and uh, the Peter from the last excursion that I was out on. Uh, keep in mind, folks, that we still have a few more people to get before I can start giving stuff away at the 500 subscriber giveaway. Hey folks, come on over here and check out what I got going on. See this? Concentrator. I'm making my own concentrator. I think I'm gonna go like this. I found some material. Uh, I have one A that I, uh, a little bit wider than this, but I'm gonna weld these two bad boys together. And I got some, uh, some stuffs, some matting. So I'm gonna try that and I got a pump. So I'm gonna put myself together a concentrator, see what happens to go with that. But here's the giveaway stuff that's got going on. Uh, I've got so far, I'm thinking here's a gift, here's a gift, here's a gift. This is a gift. This is a gift. That's a gift. There's a little, and then little kind of things from there. And I'm going to throw a couple bags of Peter, uh, my own Peter stuff that's in there as well. Hey folks, Prospector Gill here again. So this, uh, real quick, I wanted to show you the, what I got out of it. This is this is this is some of the concentrates that I got out of that hole underneath that big rock, the big huge massive rock that I pulled out. Uh, literally, I have like almost two pails of stuff. Look at how blonde this is. This is a concentrate. I already panned this particular bucket down smaller. This was full, so I I, I panned it down. So these are. Like, just crazy. Blondes upon blondes upon blondes. I don't see a whole lot of black sands in there right now. We'll see when I do it. But like see, this is like like sand almost, almost everything. 
This is from a different part of the kick. Look at all the big heavies and stuff like that on there. It's just completely a completely different color even. Completely. Um, it was just weird. Once I got underneath that big huge, that big huge rock, that's the stuff that I got. Um, here is my test. These are my test pans from that hole. Um, that way, I'm going to see what I have to look forward in all of it. I've got like three buckets of stuff that I've got to run. Um, it's amazing that that black pan, this one, you can't see the black sand and stuff when you're in there going at it. So there you go. Holy cow. Um, let's see if we can see this thing going here. So that's from a couple of test pans that I did um, out of that little pocket. So we're going to call it pocket gold, I think. There we go, folks.